Uh, hey guys, um, happy new year to you guys. Happy new year. Uh, so today I'm going to be using Maple to do uh, to assign functions, then uh, convert them to partial functions, and then differentiate the actual function itself, and then integrate it, then plot it, then find uh, the minima and maxima, so the extrema thing. Yeah, so yeah, so let's get started. So I'm going to start off with my function. Um, then I'm going to call um, y. So, so before I go, before I do that, um, I need to load the plot function. So with plot, All right? And then, if you put a colon, it won't show you the names of the functions. But, um, if you don't put the colon, it will show you all the. Uh, plotting functions that you could use, right? But I just don't, I prefer just saving the colon anyway. So, personal choice. Yeah, so yeah, so I'm gonna call my function y. So, y, yeah. And that'll be uh, 2x minus 2 divided by uh, x to the power 4, right? Minus 3x squared, right? Plus 1. So, that's my function. Right, so I need to convert that to partial functions. So I'll convert my function y to power frac. So power frac. So here we are. And then I need to differentiate my function y with respect to x. So that's my differential. Then I'm going to integrate it as well. Uh, y with respect to x. Right, interesting. Okay, and then I'm gonna plot my function as well. So plot uh, y, all my x values from uh, minus five to five. So that's my function, and then I need to find um, or do the extrema of y. Yeah, so that's minus four. Okay, and then now what I need to also do is uh, do another function, which is pretty much do the same thing. Just show you how it works. Then I'll do three D plots, right? So I'll call my function um, z. Right, so that's 5x divided by 1 plus 2x. Right, so that's my z function. And then I'm um, going to do the same as well. So convert that to partial functions. Um, z power fuck. Right, and then differentiate my z again with respect to x. Okay, and then integrate it. Z with respect to x. Right, and then plot a function uh, z with my x values uh, from minus what minus. Uh, let me just put minus eight. Yep. And then find the streamer. That's maximum minima um, of z at zero. Yeah, it's evident. Right. So um, now I've done that, I can plot the two functions on the same axis as well. So that'll be plot. And then with my curly brackets. Y and Z, uh, X equal to, let me just say minus 10 to 10. So this is just, this is just random. Right. So this is my, uh, this is my Z function right here. And this is my, um, my Y function, right? And then you could also do, uh, 
a 3D plot with uh, Maple. So I'm just going to do some random 3D plots so you can just see how the function works, how the code works. Plot and then 3D. So sin x, sin x, whichever way you want to call it, cos y. Right? And then I'll do another random one as well, another 3D plot. So plot uh, 3D. Uh, so plus 2x. Um, So here we are. So this is quite useful in 3D modeling. So um, say engineering and all that stuff here. Yeah. So guys, I want to do 3D modeling and stuff. This will be quite uh, quite handy, you know. Yeah, but uh, it's nice to to play with these uh, functions on um, on Maple, and you can do the same thing with Mathematica and um, and Python um, with the uh, same pi package yeah so yeah so that's um, just the random uh, 3d plot right and then I'll just do one more function um, a random function as well so I'm just going to call it G um, so 2x cubed right divided by oh sorry yeah so 3x right and then I'm gonna do the uh, partial functions part again so convert um, g path rock so here we are and then um, I'll differentiate it again with respect to x right and then integrate the same function as well so integrate uh, g with respect to x and then plot my favorite thing so plot g my x values from uh, minus 10 uh, to 10 weird but hey ho and then I find uh, an extrema so g there we go zero you can see that yeah so yeah guys um it was just a quick one for the new year um but i'll, I'll continue doing more videos and stuff so hopefully this is going to be helpful for someone to do partial functions and a bit of plotting and a bit of uh, integration and differentiation. It was just a quick, quick video. So yeah, have a lovely time guys and uh, I'll see you in the next shot. Cheers.